We have a principle in Judaism of Malin Bakodesh Ve'in Moritin. We ascend in Kedusha, we do not go down. Which invites the question, why do we violate this on Yom Kippur? Because the Kohen Gadol, when he does the service in the Beis HaMikdash, begins in the Kodesh HaKadashim in front of the Aron, and then he proceeds outward to the Parochet, to the Zbech Hazav, and then outside, going in stages of lower and lower and lower sanctity. That's not the way it should be. Why doesn't the Kohen Gadol begin with the Mizbeach, then get closer and go to the Parochet, and then climax with the beautiful moment in front of the Aaron in the Holy of Holies in the Kodesh HaKadash? We should do Ma'al and Ma'kodesh Reimoridin. Why does the Kohen Gadol seem to do the opposite? And Rav Shamshin Rafal Hirsch explains that what's really happening on Yom Kippur is not a descent in Kedusha, but rather an exporting of Kedusha. Let me explain. He takes that moment of unbelievable power and unbelievable intimacy in the Kodesh HaKadashim, in front of the Kruv, in front of the Shekhinah itself. But now the question is, how can he take that one moment of time and apply that to the rest of the year? Because that's the challenge of Yom Kippur itself. Think about it. We spend one day, we're in shul, we're fasting, we're davening, we're hearing drashos. It's a day where we literally are like angels. But the problem is, how does that apply to the rest of the year? And Rav Shamshun Rafal Hirsch explains that that is the experience of the Kohen Gadol. It's not a descent of Kedusha. It is capturing that moment inside the Kodesh HaKadashim and then taking it out with him to bring it to the Parochet, to bring it to the Zbeach Hazav, and then ultimately to go outside the Beis HaMikdash and to bring it to the broader world. My Rebbe Rosenzweig always says that Yom Kippur is not supposed to be an isolated bubble of the year. It is supposed to be the day that inspires and influences us as we take the Kedusha of that one day and bring it outwards to inspire and elevate the next 353 days of the calendar.